getting input from the user okay so this is uh, the main point uh, we'll discuss now and so again i do cdi.h and i have int main here uh, so in this lecture we will be talking about the function called using the function called get car so basically it stands for get character get car and we're going to use that to get input from your keyboard okay so you can uh, you know the user will have to input from the keyboard okay so later uh, in future you will see a function called a scanf can also be used to get input uh, scanf is actually much easier than get car uh, but it requires some uh, we like to talk about some other things before we reach scanf okay so so so, so therefore we are stuck with uh, something which is a uh, bit more complex to implement but we know all the things to implement that okay so get car c c equal to get car so what does it uh, let me just print it okay so get care basically takes uh, one letter from your keyboard it just takes one letter from your keyboard and i'm going to print that thing the letter from keyboard yes percentage c i'm going to print that thing and i'm going to print it here just so that um and i'm going to run that cc get car dot cc oh, i can put semicolon there it's waiting for me to input something i type in rigid and you should notice that the letter from keyboard is s okay it so when it when it waits for keyboard instruct keyboard input from keyboard it waits until it reaches an enter sign until it until we enter okay so we can type long sentence and it enter and we enter and but get care takes the first element from that okay if you want more elements you should call get care multiple times if you want to get the second letter r third letter e etc etc you have to call get care multiple times let's do that now let's so let's try to do that and then uh, and we'll uh, get all the characters so how, how how do i do that i wait i have to do a while loop basically because i, I want to call get care multiple times and how long do i do i call it multiple times until i see uh, the enter sign okay and an enter is basically a new line right once so you type in enter you go to the next line okay and now i can i'll just copy this here uh, i'll copy this below okay and now right now you should tell me what happens now right so first time get character it's called it checks whether it is is it an enter if it doesn't enter it comes here and prints that character then it collects the next character and waits keeps on doing it until uh, you enter right okay now I run this i run all right type in rigid see you got s r e e j i t h okay so if i get care i can call it multiple times and get each letter one by one what if i had got the get care first and then printed okay check that thing let's compile run i'm going to enter my name as you see it missed the first letter s because first time get car got called s was c was s second time it but then it entered here and then it got called again right so that's why it called called again and then c became r and that r is printed for and then it's called uh, until and then e e j i t h and finally get car is that enter symbol slash n therefore the slash n is again printed here that's why this uh, new line has come and 
um, you, you then go to the while loop and done.